the m3 profile is indicated by the following inequality between the various depths option a y not is greater than yc greater than y option b y is greater than y not greater than yc option c yc greater than y not greater than y option d y greater than y not yc greater than y not so if you see mild mild slope means mild slope means cdl is below ndl or ndl is above cdl so this is cdl line cdl means yc depth ndl means y not depth suppose if actual depth is here in this zone that means actual depth is y is more than y not and y not is more than yc y is more than y not and y not is more than yc then it is m1 profile if y is in this zone means suppose if yeah uh, if y is in second region then how we can write this y not is more than y and which is more than yc y not is more than y and which is more than yc that is m2 profile then if y is below this cdl that means <coughs> y not is more than yc and yc is more than y that means that is m3 profile so here m3 profile we need m3 profile that means y not is more than yc and it is more than y so option a is correct one that means if y is above ndl then it is m1 if y is in between cdl and ndl then it is m2 and if y is less than cdl then that is m3 profile based on region we can decide the profile similarly steep means in steep slope cdl is above ndl that means yc is greater than y not so here if you see yc is greater than y not generally and if uh, y is in region 1 that then y is greater than yc and y is greater than y not y is greater than yc and y is greater than y not that is just one profile similarly s2 means y y will be in between cdl and ndl so yc is greater than y and y is greater than y not similar this one y c is greater than y and y is greater than y not if y is below ndl if y is below ndl then y c is greater than y not and y not is greater than y this one s3 here if you see critical slope in critical slope ndl and cdl both are same only region 1 and 3 will be there so c1 and c3 profiles are possible if y is above y not y is above y not which is y not equal to yc y is above y not and which is equal to yc then c1 profile if y is less than y not which is y not equal to yc that is c3 profile and horizontal profiles are like this in horizontal profile only cdl exists and the ndl will be at infinity that's why region 2 and 3 only will be there here you see if you see y is more than yc of course because of horizontal s is 0 slope is 0 so this is s2 h2 and y is less than yc that means uh, y is below cdl then it is h3 for horizontal s equal to 0 for adverse slopes s is less than 0 two adverse slopes are there a2 and a3 for a2 y is greater than yc and a3 y is less than yc so all these 12 conditions can be remembered very easily by drawing ndl and cdl lines